Hi everybody, this is Dr. Paul here, and I'm here to describe the Japanese Reiki technique of Gaso to you. This is one of those wonderfully fascinating techniques that has come to us from Japanese Reiki practitioners, and with the increased contact between Japanese and Western Reiki practitioners, it's been translated, or transmitted, and translated, back to the West. So there's a couple of things we just need to go through before we're going to do it together, and yeah. So basically, I'm sitting on my knees, so I'm basically, um, but you can sit cross-legged, or you can sit um, just in a comfortable chair if anything else is not too comfortable for you. I'm going to become aware of a couple of uh, places. I'm going to become aware of my hara. So the hara is an energy center, and it's just a little bit below your belly button and uh, towards the center of your body, and it's a very central position for um, many um, Japanese techniques. And I'm also going to need to be aware of this spot between when I'm going to put my hands into a prayer position and then become aware of that. So let's begin. We're going to do this together. I want you to do this with me. So get yourself in a comfortable position, whatever it is. Make sure your posture is good. I always slouch. Deep breath in. Put your hands into the gasso position, into the praying hands position right in front of your heart. Now just become aware of your hara, just a little bit below the navel. Now become aware of Reiki as an energy flowing through you and flowing into you. Take a few moments and breathe that Reiki energy into your, into your hara, into that spot below your belly button. As your hara gets charged up with energy, it will start to glow out a little bit. You'll see that Reiki energy kind of glowing out from the haro and enveloping your whole body. Just keep going until that happens. you feel that glow enveloping your whole body, just shift your focus a little bit to that spot right here between the tips of your two middle fingers. And just keep your focus there and breathe naturally. Hold this focus for as long as you like. That is in fact the essence of that technique. It's very simple, very easy. You connect to Reiki, breathe it into your aura, breathe it out, and then hold that meditative focus. It's often usually done in the context of a, of a larger technique that I'm going to do a separate video on called Hatsureho, uh, which just adds a couple of more steps, but it's a really fun little technique. So. I will see you guys later. Thank you for watching my video. I'll talk to you later. Bye.